Yo, what up, guys? Mr. Big Rusty here, back from MDR Starcast. Uh, you're joining me for part five of the Let's Play Resident Evil 4, and we're about to open the door and see what's inside. So, yeah, nothing special. I was expecting some big ass zombie to jump out at me then, but it's all good. Let's see what we've got inside here. Nothing, nothing special there. And, oh, maybe it's inside this door what we should be looking for. Do, 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 do. Oh. Whoa. Here comes the music. A bit later than what I expected. I might be able to quickly kick him. Yeah, boy. Want to be careful any of those exploder ones. There's none here at the moment, so that's always good. Whoa! Oh, that was a shot right there. Shooting his actual axe. And again! Bitch, this guy is blatantly pissed off right now. Ah, uh, nah, they got an ass right now. They can get fucked up. Bitch! Uh, Pull that thing at me right now, I swear down. I should be able to cut this guy in half. Yeah, sweet. Reload this quickly just in case we get into another battle where we may need that. We use this green herb. We have a lot of items I don't really need at the moment, um, but we'll keep them there until we actually need to get rid of any of them. Uh, is that all the items I got? There should be another zombie around somewhere still because of the music. So, have we got another zombie anywhere? Did see a treasure earlier, so I'm gonna check if I've gone past it yet. So it's right next to me. I think it's in the opposite room. So, whoa, what's going on there? Come on. Just jump through the window as you do, hardcore as I am. Whoa, that was not a good idea. Can I crouch? Shit, that was not a good idea. Crouch, bitch, crouch. Boom! The shot. Hopefully, that's a here over there somewhere. Um, am I not shoot these? Surely I can shoot them, surely. Just in case. I see myself getting a bit clumsy as normal just walking into them, especially with such low health. Um, pull out my shotgun for the moment, just in case anything gets too up and personal with my face. Um, whoa! And that's exactly what I meant. I can hear a zombie somewhere. Just crouch quickly. There he is. Just make sure I don't want to make sure that I don't die. That would be quite painful. What you doing, boy? What you looking at? Yeah, you know that's what's not bad. How is this guy taking all these headshots? That was a headshot. That was not a throat shot. But that was a headshot right there. And he's just taking. He's just standing there. Oh, there's more going. That's just what I need. There we go, that one down. Headshot again, and they just just don't seem to die. And definitely upgraded my pistol's power next time I meet the stranger. Alright, let's uh pop some of these quickly. The music stops, so we're gonna be a little bit safe as long as you don't walk into any um silly things like that. They're everywhere. I'm just popping them all just in case. There's some I've got plenty of ammo, there's some ammo there anyway, so. Can I shoot through the box? Yeah, boy. Pure accuracy there. Curving bullets. Curving those bullets. Oh, sweet. Take the handgun ammo. Take the first aid spray. That ain't just what I needed. But that could have quite easily been avoided had I not of, um, I don't know what happened. It was a bit of an unlucky, unlucky moment, if anything, really. Um, is that treasure piece in here? Uh, what's my map? Oh, I've completely passed it. It's right here. How do I get it? Do I shoot it? That's a mask. So, there has to be a way towards it somewhere. Maybe I have to go around a little bit. Maybe that's the idea of trying to trick me. Um, let's smash up this little tube here. So, from the side, nothing special there. This place is a bit flooded. Need to get a good plumber now or something. Um, I'm hoping that I can go back to that place. And this does not seem to lead to it, so... Um, Hmm, interesting. Can I smash the wood? There we go. It was as simple as that. They were trying to trick me. I knew it would have been something pretty stupid like that. That's just the fact that I could just smash the wood and got through if I had them um, here. Hey, hey. We've done it, and that's the main thing. So it's going to be a nice little prize position to sell to the stranger when it comes to it next. So let's check out what's down in the dungeon, son. Do you... 
Alright, man. Oh, I don't know if kick him. I hope I was going to be able to kick him. Uh, I'm going to get that shot and I'll kill him. Boom. Now climb up and climb up. Come on, come on, come on. He's dead. He dead. Um, so I either climb up or I climb down. Um, well, down does not seem like a good option. That seems like there could be some dirty shit down there. But I'm taking the risk. Whoa, what the fuck is that? What the fuck was that? Ah, oh, it's fish. <laughs> That's so okay, though. Know. I have a hunch the stranger is around this area. I don't know why. Maybe I'm... Maybe there's a similar location like this where the stranger is yet. Um, no, it's just fish. Nothing too special. I'm going to pop the fish. Boom. What did he give me? Take the black bass. What does it do? Maybe you eat it or something. I haven't really that fast, to be honest. And I'd probably sell some of those grenades or something there. Um, but I'm pretty sure there's got to be some way you can store your items and check with a stranger again. But, um... Yeah, it's kind of annoying. I do need to know if I can still want them because I'm pretty sure you know, when you get all the guns, like you can't hold like the all of them, like machine gun, rifle, and everything. So you point just buying them and then just uh, throwing them away. What's for weapons recovery? That's what I mean. Um, all right, let's check my map quickly to see if there's any more treasure I've got. So I've got that one, and there's one in this room, supposedly. Um, I don't think that means it's up, or I've actually missed it down here. Maybe that's the reason why you have to go down here. Should we check here? No, that's not there. Uh, maybe it's in this fish. Maybe it's in the actual fish where it is. Um, there's a big fish. I want to find a big fish. There it is. He looks like it. If anything, he could have a treasure in him. It's not interesting. Alright, we'll check outside. I don't want to be missing this ship. There's probably something. It's probably just outside. But if it's down there, I'd be pretty pissed off myself the fact that I missed it. Let's have a look. Let's climb up. Maybe it's in that house. There it is. That's probably it there. That could well be it there. That could explain everything. It stinks here too. Well, that's great. We got the dirty pocket watch. Let's have a look if that's the item we were looking for. Bingo. We got a save point coming up, so good stuff. That's what always we need. And here's some crows or something somewhere. I don't know if I'm going to Yeah, boom. Let's see that coming. I can see there being a snake. I have not seen a snake in this game yet, so I'm, I'm waiting for one to pop out on me or something. Shotgun shells, always nice and useful. And nothing there, so nothing useful there. Whoa. Just in case. It's a, bit of a nice bit of gold. I must have killed something. I must have killed some crows or something. Must have been there. Um, not 100 sure on that one. But. Yeah, it's all good. Alright, let's go up here then. To this creepy building and see what's lying about. Lurking about for me to get hit by. It's a large crystal ball. It looks like it rotates. Which way we turn it? Um. Ah, oh, it's a symbol, isn't it? It's going to be that symbol which is on the side there, obviously. Ah, there we go. That was easy enough. Something activated. <laughs> Ooh. Scary. Let's go rob this guy's, uh, oh, it's a key. You got the sound key. Let's check this guy. He looks pretty beastly. He was the guy who injected that shot into me, I think. Uh, they're all textbooks written in English, but I don't have time to read them. Well, you know, I've got time, man. We could read a bit English. So what's on this bear to take? Chief's note. Let's have a little read through this. I'm going to read it to you like a little book, guys. Just imagine there's pictures and stuff, and I'm a narrator. <laughs> um, but my English is probably going to be messed up. I always mess up on big words. You know, that's, you know, being fluent in English, being an English person, I just can't speak it properly. But we'll try. As instructed by Lord Sadler, I have the agent in confinement, alive. Why keep him alive? Question mark. I do not fully understand what the Lord's intentions are, full stop. I would, comma, however, comma, think he'd keep the sep them separate, not confine them together as he's been ordered, full stop. I don't expect Lewis would trust a stranger, but if by chance they did cooperate, comma, the situation could get a bit more complicated, full stop. If for some reason, comma, an unknown third party is involved, comma, I don't think they'd let a chance like that slip by, full stop. But maybe it's all Lord Sanders' ploy, leaving us vulnerable so that it's the third party will sell us, comma. 
if they even ex exist, that is, full stop, full stop, full stop. It's an unlikely possibility, comma. But if a prowler is already amongst us, comma, then our plans could be ruined. I guess the Lord thinks it's worth the risk if we're able to stop whatever conspiracy is at work. Full stop. At any rate, it, comma, it's the Lord's call. Full stop. We will trust his judgment as all things. Some very faithful people right there. Some very faithful people. Alright, um, I did want to check. Oh, what's that? Can I do that? Has something come up? Something come up. Open. Sweet. Some hand gamma. Can't go wrong with that. Um, I do want to check what's in here. I have something might be in here. Nice bit of gold. Some sweet, good stuff. Let's go through this door, see where this leads us. <laughs> like they wouldn't hear that door shut. Oh shit, son. Back with a big guy. You carry the same blood as us, it seems. Nevertheless, you're an outsider. Just remember, if you become unpleasant to our eyes, you'll face severe consequences. So, like, why doesn't he kill them, though? They're surely just made... What? Same blood. You know, he could have quite easily have just killed me there, and that would have been, that would have ended everything. That would have been the end. It would have been a nice day. The game would have been over, and that would have been it. But he didn't. So hey ho. Uh, enemies killed. Fifty in that one. Eighty percent. Eighty-five percent hit ratio. So my aim got a little bit better during that. Uh, number of times killed. Didn't die during that. So booyah. But unfortunately, I do still have that one death from that moment where I was able to undodge that rock. But let's uh, make a new save again. It's on one point. Oh no, no, one point two still. But we can save over that with one point three. Um, so yeah, good stuff. Saving. Leon, I've been able to get some new info that might help you. Fill me in. Apparently, there's a religious cult group involved. They're called the Los Illuminados. Los Illuminados? <laughs> That's a mouthful. Anyway, I had an unexpected run-in with the big cheese of this village. But you're okay, right? Yeah. But he could have killed me, but he let me live. And he mentioned something about me carrying the same blood as them. Whatever that means. Carry the same blood? Huh. Interesting. Anyway, there are more important things than solving riddles right now. You're right. Hurry and find that church, Leon. Alright, chin up, beach. Keep your pantyhose on. Alright, so we just came through that door. So let's have a look what's in here quickly. Open. Oh, green herb. Nice. Do I not even have enough room for it, do I? Well, that sucks. Let's just get rid of some of these grenades then. Um, let's use a flash grenade. Hopefully, I can chuck it out the window. Whee! Any time now? Oh, that's the Let's see what it actually does if we throw it inside. Bam. Did I just kill a zombie by the sounds of things? That's kind of cool if I just did kill an actual zombie. I don't know if I did. It sounded like I did. I'm pretty sure this is where the chainsaw guy is around this area as well. Um, right, let's go get that other green herb now. And we can mix them two together anyway, so save a bit more space. Mine with that one. Right, sweet. I'm gonna get my shotgun out just in case. I don't like the sound. I'm pretty sure I have a feeling that the guy's actually around here. And I do feel like I've killed a zombie, to be honest. Bitch. Definitely killed that one anyway. I hope so. Doesn't seem to be dead somehow. You know, you should fucking unload a load of shotgun shells into him and uh, he just walks away and doesn't even give me anything. What a bitch. Alright. Check. Looks like the people in this house eat like normal humans. Oh, very good. Alright, let's save anyway. Let's save up. So yeah, this was uh, part number five, I do believe, guys. Um, I hope you enjoyed watching. This is Mr. Big Rest back from MBR Starcast. Uh, I will be shortly working on part six, so stay tuned. Peace, guys.